Hello everybody and welcome to another box tail scoop. You can tell we've been rehearsing together. We're just in Can you really? If you watch tail. this back, you'll see there's a slight funny expression on my face as I forget again what the tail move is. But there we are. Um, it's been a long week, but a very fun week. And tonight is the first night of our Christmas carol, which I will not believe, I don't think, until I step out onto the stage <laughs> and say the first line. Yeah. Because it's quite extraordinary. We know, we are very, very well aware how incredibly lucky we are to be doing a show. And it is just utterly heartbreaking to know how many people will not be doing the show that they have lovingly crafted for this year. Um, friends of ours who we know aren't able to do their shows. And so we, we just feel, um, I don't really know how to describe it really, but... It's just such a strange thing to, to be waiting on that announcement. When, when was it? Thursday or Friday? I can't remember. We were, the anyway, other day, we, anyway, we were rehearsing and so the announcement was happening while we were rehearsing, so we mm. didn't find out until we'd finished our little And work. I looked at my phone, in fact, and my best friend had sent me a message saying, thank goodness, you know, you were in tier two, but... But to but sort of be waiting for something completely beyond your control mm. that could either mean everything has to stop or, okay, you can go ahead. And, and I just, know, you know... We're I'm, very grateful, very lucky. Yeah. Because, as you just said, you know, lots of people we know who uh, were doing shows in London, who were doing shows in other areas... Various areas of the country. Mm. So tier three and... Uh, we, I can't, I just... Yeah. yeah. Anyway. So we're feeling very fortunate mm. and quite right until we're actually there on stage with the audience, which will be the first time that we've performed in a theatre with an audience since March. March mm. I mean, we did the outdoor it. shows, obviously, but they were on the beach, so they were a little different. Um, we are very excited. As you can see, we're not in the theatre. In the theatre at the moment is the Panto that's going brilliantly here, as far as we know. I mean, we can't get in to see it because it's so full. So uh, we are in our studio theatre at the, at the Everyman. I say our studio, it feels like home. This is where we normally perform. So we would normally come and do all of our shows in here. It's currently our green room because the theatre is being very, very careful about keeping the two companies completely separate. So we basically, like ships passing in the night, we don't see each other. We've not met any of the Panto company at all um, because the idea is that we kind of live on one side of the theatre and they live on the other and that we don't intersect so that we can keep everyone safe. And they, they have been amazing. There's, there's hand sanitizer everywhere. The only reason we're not checks. wearing masks right now is because we're on, we're, our own. we're on our own. There's nobody else here. Covid tests and all that. People, so People yeah, have been tested uh, regularly. Yeah. So they're doing everything they can. So we are in the, in the studio, which is our green room, and we're going to do a little run in here before the show later. So we've brought the puppets up here and a couple of and the trunks and a couple of little bits of scenery so that we can have a little play. Um, but we're going to do a very gentle run this afternoon just to warm up, really ready for the actual show, show this evening. We, um, I think, you no, know, I think you've taken a couple of photos. Have you taken a couple of photos? Yes. So yesterday when we did the dress rehearsal, we had someone in to film the show properly. Yes. And hopefully we'll get some lovely footage and some lovely photos from that. Um, in the meantime, obviously our time is very limited and it's, very, it's been very difficult, but I've tried to grab a few little photos here and there of the, um, the set up on stage and of it kind of in the space so you can see a little bit more of the theatre. So um, we'll... Pop we'll, those at the end? Yeah, we'll, yeah. we'll show you a few of those at the end. And, and uh, the idea is that you're going to try and get a little video, aren't you, of the which we will show at another point when we've got time to catch that. Mm. So it's not the most flattering, but hopefully you can get a sense of what it all looks like together. And when we get the footage back from, uh, from the chap who filmed it, then we'll be able to share some, uh, some really nice looking footage, hopefully. So yeah, so it's all, it's all very exciting. It looks wonderful under the lights. We're absolutely thrilled. We're oh. really thrilled as well because it fills the space. And that was something that we were a little concerned about. Obviously, we've not... We've not designed a show for a main house before. We've performed in main houses with some of our other shows and just kind of, you know, use the lighting to reduce the, the space. But we haven't designed a show for a main house and our studio obviously is relatively small. So in terms of the, our workshop as in, so we couldn't fit the set in there, could we? So we hoped that it would fit on yeah. a main stage. And well, it's a strange thing to have built it all and not have been able to put it all up no. and see it all together. And very nerve-wracking. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, very you nerve-wracking. Know. But it looks great. Yeah. They've done a lovely job with the lighting. Yeah, everything. Michael's done a fabulous job with the lighting. And um, we're being looked after royally here with Karen and everything as well. So, yeah, it's going well. And we're really excited. Um, 
exhausted. Great. Because it's well, been it's been a lot of long days yes. of, uh, as we said before, you know, because we have to take care of everything as well. We've also been we've been rehearsing during the days and then sorting out a few bits of like props and things and tweaking and like... or fixing little bits of costume that need yeah. things doing, doing the program for the show, sorting out the, um, the the sound cues and stuff like that in the evenings. So uh, yeah, we are we're tired, running on adrenaline, very excited, and then after we've done the first one this evening. Uh, yeah, we can't we can't say anything about it at the moment without knocking on wood. Um, but there we are. So yes, that's how we're feeling. Very very lucky. Very excited. A bit tired, but all in a good way. And uh, and just utterly thrilled to be here. Yeah. And we can't wait to get a, a reaction from you know we. It's always the same thing when you've been rehearsing a show, mm -hmm. and uh, it gets to a certain point that you really need to have people in the room. You need to have someone to perform it to. And you need to have a little bit of a feedback to see, you know, where where you maybe where you might get a little laugh, or where you might get certain you feel the atmosphere in the room. You get some some response from an audience. And we're at that stage where I can't wait to, to perform it in front of people. So yeah, so we will talk again, I guess, after we've done the shows. Uh, we'll probably do another vlog at some point next week. Obviously, it's Christmas week next week, so please do excuse us if you're waiting a little longer for the next episode but we'll do our best and thank you as always for watching if you've watched this far of our real ramblings today then thank you very very much and uh, thank you for bearing with us as well because i know we've not been as forthcoming with the vlogs in the last few weeks it just has been a bit of mayhem really um but uh, we're really <laughs> thrilled that you know we keep getting new subscribers and your comments have been lovely and encouraging and thank you so if you have enjoyed it or and you haven't subscribed yet, you need to do Yeah, hit the subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, leave us a comment, all of that stuff would be great. Yeah, and uh, if we don't see you before, happy Christmas and uh, wish us luck for this evening. <laughs>